make it more challenging to chisel that bone out. So try to keep the path of your cuts with the anatomy of the jaw. Yes, and the parameters of the length of the cut. And the cut is two to three. Yeah, no, the trep line is different. The trep line, you're just going to go and take that piece out. So you, you, some, if you're going to use a trep line drill in the same spot, you don't have to worry because that shelf, you can go straight down and harvest that, that trep line. But if you're using the piezo, the cut has to be in the same angle. Right? Yes. As you're cutting with the piezo, you're going to know that your through cortical bone, when, when the piezo starts to give and drop, when it drops, that's it. You don't cut anymore. If you're chiseling bone in the ramus and you hear thud, 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 and it doesn't move, don't just think you need to hammer harder. That, what does that mean? There's a place in your cut that isn't through cortical bone. Go ahead. What I was also telling you, uh, the docs over here, guys, listen up. This is real. Hold on, guys. That's not real important. Look at the cutting tip of that piezo. The cutting tip of that piezo is about four to five millimeters, okay, before it narrows down. Normally, when you're going through cortical bone, use that as a depth guide, okay? And you'll feel it drop in. All right, so don't bury it past that three to five because your nerve is right below, okay? And as I was telling the group over here, look at your pen. You can even look at a simple panorex before you do the case. Look at the position of your nerve, okay? As I was saying, sometimes you have a really high nerve, go to another technique, okay? Always assess that before you even do your cone beam scan. Look at your panorex and see what's going on. All right, but use the cutting tip, and that's why they make them three to five millimeters, because the cutting tip helps you to define where you're going. There's also, there's a like a right angle piezo tip in there. I like to use that one for my inferior cut. Yes. Okay, the right angle, use that one for the inferior cut. And like I told another group over here, I'm all the short of dentists in here. When you look at 